with your right foot. Swing both your arms to the right. Left foot does not move. Watch your hands as you go. For a little bit of a challenge, you can look to the side and keep your head there. Awesome. A couple more. Feel that mid back start to warm up. All right, let's go ahead and switch to the left foot now. Step back with your left, swing both of your arms to the left. Very good. Can you get, I, I don't know if you guys can see Leo, he's looking just dashing, <laughs> sitting here watching me. And that's it, good. Okay, second exercise. We're gonna do a squat. If you have weight, you can hold it in your hands. I'm gonna use these weights today. If you don't, you're just gonna pass your hands here. Feet a little wider than the shoulder width with toes out. I want you to hinge forward a little bit, drop that chest towards the ground, come back up. Good. Toes can go out a little bit. Feet go wider with your toes out if you feel your knees while you're doing these. Amanda, my back is objecting to that. What else can I do instead? Go ahead and just um, hinge forward instead to give yourself okay. that little stretch in the hamstrings, okay? Thank you for asking. Couple more. Oh, Paul and Jean, hi, you guys. Hey, hi. how you doing? Great, how are you? Good, good. All right, awesome. We're moving on to a bent over lift. One weight in your hand or the band around your wrist or body weight. Feet are shoulder width apart, hinge forward a little bit. You're just gonna lift those arms up and back down nice and slow. Notice how my chest doesn't move. Very good. Awesome. Keeping your back flat, your core tight. You can bend those elbows a little bit, Linda. Just kind of bring your arms here. So those arms don't come overhead. Awesome. And excellent. Okay, next one. Back to band around your wrists or weight in your hands or body weight. Feet are shoulder width apart. You're going to hinge forward, back flat, and then come up a little faster. One, two, three, and up. Feel that nice pull in the back of your legs for the hamstrings. Again, back flat, most important part. Linda, of course, arm, yep, you got that. Only one arm overhead for you. Good work. Going, nice little ump on the way up, squeezing your glutes at the top. Couple more. Sugar, come over and watch. All right, very good. Next one. Hands, if it's your body weight, I want you to push your hands together in front of you. Linda, this will be a good one to start to slowly activate your shoulder. Push your hands together. If you have weight, I have a light weight you can push. Feet are shoulder width apart, knees are soft, and I'm gonna twist my arms right to left. A little bit of oomph in the middle, and then slow it down. Awesome, everybody, looking good. Good, keep going. Good, 
and try and keep your hips still so it's just your arms moving. Ooh, mine start to really burn by the end. Couple more. Again, this is plenty hard with just your body weight. So feel it through your biceps and your chest and your core, a little bit of shoulders. And done. Awesome. Okay, next one. Body weight only, or you can hold the weight here if you want the challenge. This is plenty hard without. We're just going to do a step back lunge, alternating right to left, okay? You don't have to bend the knees too much. Just get that good extension from your hips. Try and shift your weight to your front heel. Good. Brace that wobble. Balance isn't challenged if you're not off balance. I'm going. We've got a few more to go. Excellent. One more of each. And terrific. Okay. Body weight or light dumbbells. We're going to do a bent over fly. Okay. So feet are shoulder width, hinge forward, no more than five pounds. If you have heavier weight, make a more of a W. If it's just your body weight, just bring them to the side so you form a nice T. Spine is in neutral, head and neck is neutral. Nice work, you guys. Great. Keep going. Feel those shoulders burning. Make sure that shoulder, neck is relaxed. And awesome. Okay, weight goes to the side again. Or you can hold one weight here for a challenge. And we're doing an alternating curtsy lunge. Curtsy here. Curtsy here. Yep. Remember, you don't have to bend your knees too much. Just get that good uh, different uh, motion. Very good. Again, weight still shifts to that front heel, loading up your glutes. That's how you get them. Awesome. Keep going, we've got a few more. Two. And last one, quick feet, just body weight for this. So you really get your arms kind of moving. There we go, 45 seconds here, just running in place. And then we'll take a quick water break. And then we'll begin. Second round, great job everybody. Keep going. That's right, moving those feet, moving those arms. Low impact, so it's gentle on the joints, but you're still getting your heart rate up. You guys have 15 seconds left. Ten. Five seconds. Three, two, done. Awesome. Okay, go ahead and get some water if you want. Everybody's doing awesome. Right, Chuck? Everybody doing a good job? Okay, everyone good? Thumbs up? Fantastic. Yay, thumbs way up. Good. Great. Okay. So now back to the thoracic rotations to make these harder. You can turn your head, keep your head facing one way. 
and really swing those arms to the side. So see how now my head is not moving? That's the harder version. Now that we're a little warmed up, it'll be a nice twist on your back. Right foot still stepping back. Left leg does not move. Awesome. Good job, you guys. Swinging those arms. And go ahead and switch to the other side. Right foot's planted. I'm looking to my left and my head is not moving. Really swinging those arms. Feel right on the mid back. Great. Couple more. All right, we're going into those goblet squats, or for you, Marcy, just do a nice kind of toe touch again, okay? Weight here if you want weight. If you don't, body weight's fine. Feet a little bit wide, toes out slightly. Hinge forward, drop that chest down, come on back up. Good, make sure that back is flat. I am dropping my chest some, keeping my core tight. Notice how I'm going down a little slow, kind of one, two, up and one. One, two, up. Awesome. Okay, good guys. Couple more. Heart rate gets up. Legs and core. And Terrific, okay. Set one dumbbell down, band around your wrist, body weight, or a light dumbbell, feet or shoulder width apart, drop that chest down. You're gonna lift those arms up towards your ears and back down. Core is tight. This is actually more of a core exercise than it is an arm, because you really keep that chest dropped forward Good work, good work. A couple more. Make that core staying tight. And awesome, good. Okay, next one. Both dumbbells again, or band around your wrist or body weight. We're gonna do a shoulder width apart. Nice, one, two, and up. So same kind of concept, one, two, and up. When I'm going forward, my back stays flat. Squeeze the glutes at the top. Awesome. Looking good. Couple more. Last one. Very good job, guys. All right, set the weight down. We've got one weight or body weight. You're gonna push that weight together in front of you. My feet are about shoulder width. Nice pelvic floor, knees soft, and we're twisting right to left. Try and keep your hips still. This is really gonna twist your back. Awesome. This is a hard one. Keep going. <laughs> Leo's watching my arms move and I can see him turning his head. <laughs> Couple more guys, good job. Keep pushing with those hands together or the weight if you've got one in your hands. Hang in there. And done, terrific. Okay, you can set the weight down. 
We have the alternating reverse lunges now. So just step back with one leg and then the other. Embrace the wobble. Drop the weight all the way to that front heel so you load up the glutes. Awesome. Good job, you guys. Keep going. Ooh, it's getting warm in here. Hi, same here. I bet. Kind of open the doors, darn it. I know. So tough. And done. Awesome. Okay, next one. Both weights, lightweight or body weight for those bent over flies. So feet are shoulder width, knees soft, hinge forward. You're going to bring your arms to the side and back together. Awesome. Make sure that head and neck are a neutral spine. <clears throat> awesome. Looking good, everybody. Couple more. And awesome, set, put the weight down or you can hold the weight in your hands at chest height and we have alternating curtsy lunges. All the weight loads to that front heel. Very good. Good job, you guys are doing great. Couple more. And set the weight down. We've got 45 seconds of quick feet. Let's get that sweat going. Here we go. Go ahead and begin. Woo. 45 seconds, shaking everything out. <clears throat> okay, you're halfway. You got that pace a little bit. You got one more round after this. Ten seconds left. Three, two, okay, go ahead and rest. Get a sip of water. I'm gonna grab a little myself. Quick water break, and we got one more round of these exercises. Good job, you guys. <clears throat> 